Hey guys, coming back with the big bad wolf named Big B. Sheriff Big B. And Sweet Chin's playing Sheriff Big B. I'm investigating the toad. Okay, there has to be something killed. I might turn the little highlighters on. Uh, settings. Gameplay. Show selectables. Let's just see. So I think I've already found it. Oh, that does make it a bit too easy, doesn't it? There's blood. Blood. It's just some wood rot. Not mold or anything. There's more blood over here. Oh? Really? Yeah. Still fresh. Well, like I told you, I cut me hand. Ran around like a tit trying to pick out a rap. Must have got tongue? some on the furnishments. Bloody hell, Bigby. What sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left the tap water running. Didn't stop the recycling. What's the point of all this, mate? Really? Wait, you cut your hand? You told me before that you cut your foot. Yeah, no, I, I did cut my hand. I cut my hand first, and that made me drop the damn thing on my foot. <laughs> uh, ruinous flip of events, really. Sheriff Bigby. Oh my god, will you not make a big faff out of this? There's nothing to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? Skewer the frog. He's a dick. I mean, things happen, you know. No crime in a little accident. I think maybe you're hiding something. Hiding something? Maybe. But, uh, to tell you the truth, I don't know yet. But I know you're lying about something. But I'm not- and you're just gonna make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm not bullshitting you. Honest. We'll see. You're a liar. Bigby, come on. I'm begging for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon. Just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this... the sniffing around at me private belongings. I'm sorry I called. Really, I am. But will you please, please, just bugger off? Not yet. Not yet? You say, to my face, that you think I'm hiding something from you? Well, you've had the guy of the room for a fair bit of time now. Nothing's here. So when? When the are you going to leave? Oh dear. I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody home. It's not seemly. When? When you start telling me the truth, Toad. Well, I've told you the truth, mate. Jesus Christ, what more do you want? I cut me end. I broke the lamp. Toad, these stories have made no sense. You I'm didn't cut yourself the on the poker. You didn't forget your keys. You didn't bump the lamp off the table. You want to tell me what's going on? She doesn't think much of me, I don't think. Oh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Progress? Lots. <gasps> Mr. Toad, you're bleeding. Take off the hat. Oh yeah, he's got a hat. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a tweedle. Damodi, you gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. They come bulging in, screaming about something a woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window, but he pulled me back in. <sighs> it's been a hard morning, I can tell you that. What was he looking for? I have no idea. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. He even tried to give Fair a bath to the coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. Uh, sometimes. <laughs> borrows. I don't steal nothing. 
turnaround here would astonish you, mate. We'll merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. Great, if she Robin. has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Fine bit of dress it is. Donkey skin. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. Wouldn't fit you, mate. It wouldn't fit Wait. you. Give it a note. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. With my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? Don't Open make it. it a dilemma. I'm sorry, Faith. What could she have been sorry for? I had to read it, I'm a sure. I don't know. But maybe Lawrence does. Maybe, maybe, Well, maybe. it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. <laughs> it was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. Goodbye. Hope to see you again real soon, kid. <sighs> Gotta smoke. What? Does it always go that smoothly? Not often. So, the prince is now? Lawrence is. Yeah. It's our best lead. He's dead. Our only He's lead, fucking really. dead. When you put it that way. See, the thing about Telltale games, like, if you played The Walking Dead, you'll know uh, this, the choices you make can have such an effect later on that you never I don't want to stay it. here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Okay, Snow. Just humor me. We're here to question Lawrence. Bump him up on the suspect list, or cross him off entirely. Okay. What is it? I just... I just don't think he did it. In cases like these, isn't it usually the husband? For Mundy's, maybe. But this is different. I wasn't saying it was him. Hey, I'm a sheriff. Sheriff Big Bay. Snow, you come. Can you hear me? Don't just peep into someone's house. Check if he's home. I was trying to be nice. I didn't want to bust in. Trust me, if it's bad for you, what do you think his life would have been bad, Wolf? He was already dead though, the mirror, you know. Yeah. Oh my god. He's alive! Go get Dr. Swinehart. I'll stay with no. him. No! No! Let me go. He's head! <laughs> What is it that you're telling us? Oh. Oh. Bigby, water. water. Kitchen. Yeah, I got snow. We need a cup. Okay, maybe Bigby's got one. He's got one! He's got one! It's all good. I'm coming! Da, 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 da. Why does he want water if he said let me go and he's got a massive hole in his head? If you have something to ask him, you should do it now. You could help. I have. Who did to you? Did you hurt her? What happened? I'll say what happened. What happened? General. <laughs> Faith. Hey, 
you fucking with me? Didn't help. Come on, dude. Do you still have that letter? Yes. It's only two words, but he died without seeing them. I'm sorry. You need to figure out what happened here and find whoever did this. Do you think this makes it too easy having a circle of things on to tell me? I'll get it off. Bullet. Give me a gun. Should have looked it for Guys, I'm sorry my computer fucked up for some reason. What are they? Prescription sleeping pills. Okay. So, he shat blood out of his... Bleh, blood? He shat blood out of his ass. took some pills because he wanted to go to sleep, Fell, pulled the trigger on the gun while also slitting his wrists. Yeah, I kind of need that knife. That doesn't really help. Oh, shut up. Where's my cursor? No. Look at his head. See what done the damage. Nice blade. The mirror showed me this. Maybe I should have come here first. No, don't worry. It's sharp. There's blood on the blade. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? We don't know yet. Yes, no. We don't know. I have that knife. Strange. Hard edge to this pool, like something was here and got moved. I really do like Big B. Sniff it. Taste it. Still a little sticky. When do you think that was taken? Before all this. Still a little sticky. So is he short, Bullet maybe? Pass through the chair. Works if you shot him himself. Why'd you shoot yourself, dude? So I think he killed himself. Thing is, I reckon Toad would have cleared up the place if I didn't um, go to him first. So. I wouldn't have found out as Tweedledum, Tweedledee, whatever the name is. Ah, oh, sweet! Hey, Snow, you know. There's a bed. Two of us. What is that? 
My dear... Hey, I was reading that! My dearest Faith, I never meant to hurt you and I cannot... Give me the fucking note. Let's start to the bed a little. My dearest Faith, I never meant to hurt you and I cannot endure knowing that I have. This was for the best. I'll see you again. Love, your devoted Lawrence. Hopefully they're together now. About all we can hope for at this point. There's blood up here. Going on. <sighs> I think I sent L. Pay the, pay the rent next week. Pizza in the fridge. Please don't look for me. I think I said Lawrence or. One more time, I just want to see goodbye F. Yeah, for Lawrence Faith. Snow, what did you find? Secondhand paperbacks. Old encyclopedias. Dusty. No one's read these in a while. Stay here. No. Huh. Pull some muscles. Ow. That wasn't fun. Hey, stop. Tweedle dumb. Come on. Leave here. me alone. You're a wolf. Huh? Huh? Oh, fuck off. I, I dodged that. Okay. Come on, Big Bear! This one. Window! He almost gave you this. Fuck off! Where I'm pressing these buttons, guys. Don't worry, don't worry, I can still get this guy. Did I... I got hey. him! Bigby, you're a wolf, come on! Wolf out on We're on the same side here. You. son of a bitch. Make me. Run after you. Who are you? <sighs> what? Who are you? Listen, man. I'm a private investigator. Smothered in blood. A man's dead. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Bullshit. You're covered in blood. Look, I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Right in front of me. I couldn't stop him, man. There right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions, too. Who are you, exactly? I'm D, and I'm a private investigator. There's a business card in my shirt pocket. You can see for yourself. This is for a sandwich shop. Really? Huh. Must have run out. He, Who hired you? Wolf I can't out. tell you that. It's confidential. Sorry. Sure you understand. Wolf nope. out, Beak. Can't say that I do. 
Come on, you're coming with me. This could have been easy. Oh, don't worry. It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Tweedle dumb. It'll be much easier for you. No, to... I'm D. He's dumb. You almost looked peaceful. Yep. Except you're lying in a dirty alley. Yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. Where'd they go? Well, after the one guy hit you, and the other one finished kicking you... That explains the ribs. Why didn't you help? Then they jumped into a car and drove off. Come on, get up. Guess we're out of options. D mentioned the trip trap. Then that's where we'll go. I'll call a cab. Fuck. Hey. Every time I think I'm getting a handle on what's going on, things just get more complicated. No, no. It feels like we're always a step behind. The woodsman is the only lead we've got, and he was one of the last people to see Faith alive. Getting some answers out of him will start to clear things up. I hope you're right. Bigby? Be honest with me. Who do you think... did this? Shit, I know it's still early, but... I just feel a step behind. It's an uncomfortable feeling. The guy, I mean guys who attacked me, D and Dumb, they've got something to do. Gonna run out. Sorry, guys, I caught in a you bit. think so? I don't know how or why just yet, but if you're asking, it's a hunch. Had to name someone. He keeps coming out with Bluebeard, but I don't know who Bluebeard is. I know I mentioned him before, but I don't remember who was that. Thanks I for wish you. there was. <laughs> Sorry. I was just going to say thanks for the help. It's been appreciated. Uh, that's all. Of course. I'm just glad I haven't been in the way. Far from it. You haven't done much, so, but... It's nothing. I just... Seeing all this today, there are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the Woodlands, you forget there's a whole community out there to serve. To have to turn to... Prostitution. I... I wish there was more we could do. This isn't how I thought it would be. But Crane runs things his own way. You're doing your best. It's all anyone can do. Obviously you don't know what I do all day. Right now, I'm the gatekeeper. Making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are... As he puts it, wasting his time. You'll fix it. Yeah! I don't know. It's just a broken system. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door, through the proper channels, asking for anything, needing help. Well, I turn you away. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. A way to help. You'll figure it out. You're better than I am with this political stuff. Well, that's not saying much. 
I trust you to make the right decision. I hope you're right. Uh, maybe you should handle this one. Yeah, maybe I should. Begby. Yeah. What up, Snow? I... Um, just be careful. Please. I will. The same goes for you. I will. Gotta cut this video. Going into overtime here. Ha! It's saved. And because it's saved, it's got a bit. It sort of seemed jazzy at the time, but yeah. Because it's saved, Sweet Shins is signing off. Hope you've enjoyed this episode. I think it's been great. It's been like a Sherlock Bigby, bitches. So yeah, uh, stay tuned for more. We'll get to fight the Huntsman, I think, or Woodsman, maybe. I don't know. Depends if he's in the bar or not. And I'm so going to kill Tweedledum Tweedledee, so stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay sweet.